snow is quickly melting now, which might lead to the discovery of a broken mailbox. Wayne 15's Brianne Boswell found out how plow companies in the area handle replacing those. She joins us in Studio 15 now with more. Snow plows have been hard at work throughout the winter, working to remove snow from the roadways. The weight of the snow might have left your mailbox damaged. As of last Friday, Allen County Highway had about 90 complaints of damages to mailboxes, and they say most of them have been inspected. There are a few ways to avoid mailboxes sustaining damage. First is to check your mailbox before the snow comes to see if it's in good and stable condition. If not, or if you'd like to avoid it being close to the road, move it. You want to clear the snow kind of leading up to your mailbox and then obviously around your mailbox too. Um, that way it's also helpful for your um, mail carriers. Um, but by plowing that snow or shoveling that snow away from mailboxes, um, it'll help prevent any kind of damage that you might uh, sustain from snow. Another way is to make somewhat of a splash guard for your mailbox and spray paint your house number on it so you don't miss out on any mail. Both Allen County Highways and NDOT have processes to go through if you believe that your mailbox was damaged due to a truck plowing away snow. NDOT's complaints go to the Attorney General's office when you file a tort claim. The process for that can be found on their website. A link is on Wayne.com. Allen County Highways only takes responsibility if the mailbox was physically hit by the snow plow itself. In that case, they will replace it. Coming up, find out some more helpful tips and tricks on how to prepare your mailbox before the next big snow. In Studio 15, Brian Boswell, Wayne 15 News.